This is my bikini competition leg day workout. Hello fam and welcome to my channel. My name's Melissa Neal and this channel is all about helping you if you're a woman over 40 or like me over 50 get in fantastic shape. And today I'm going to show you a typical leg day workout which I am doing in preparation for my next bikini competition. You guys have requested that I show you one of my workouts. My next competition was scheduled for April but it's now been postponed. We haven't had a date yet and I will link a playlist in the description that tells you all about my preparations for my next bikini show. As a bikini competitor, legs and glutes are really important and so for that reason I actually work legs and glutes three times a week. This is quite a tough leg workout, which I'm doing from home at the moment because the gyms are actually shut. And I've managed to make some really good progress just with home workouts. In this workout, I'm gonna be using 10 kilo dumbbells, which is about 22 pounds. I'm gonna be using 16 kilo dumbbells, which is about 35 pounds. And I'm gonna be using an 18 kilo kettlebell which is about 40 pounds. So let's get into it. Let's get into the workout. I'm gonna start off with some mobility exercises just to get my glutes fired up before I do my leg workout. And this ensures that I'm actually working my glutes properly during the workout. I'll be doing three sets of 10 of each exercise, but what I'll do is I'll just show you one set of 10. First of all, we're gonna start off with the standard squat on our shoulders. So I've got a pair of dumbbells. These are my 10 kilo or 22 pound dumbbells, and I'm just gonna put them on my shoulders, and we're gonna do 10 squats. And you can see I'm going really low to the ground. And if you can get your squats so you're going really low to the ground like that, it's gonna be so much better. Next up, I'm gonna be doing the goblet squat, which is a little bit quad focused. I'm gonna use a kettlebell, but you can just use a dumbbell. Hold it close to my chest there, and then we're gonna go down in the squat for 10. Next up, I'm going to be doing something called a sumo squat. And a sumo squat is a little bit more glute focused, or it's sometimes known as a plie squat. And what we do is we get our legs quite wide apart and our toes pointing out. And then we go down into a squat like that. And it's a bit difficult to get low into the squat when you're doing a sumo squat, as you can with a standard squat. So don't worry if you can't get too low in the squat, just do what you can.
step I'm going to be doing a Bulgarian split squat. So these are great because what you're doing is actually just squatting on one leg. So it's really going to challenge your muscle. So I'm going to pick up the slightly lower weight dumbbells. Then I'm going to put one foot on the bench or you can use a chair and then go down into the squat. And then we're going to change leg, do the other leg. I'm going to be doing a superset which I love to incorporate in my sessions. So that's performing one exercise after the other. And I'm starting off with a stiff leg deadlift. So that's performed like this. And so it's a stiff leg deadlift. And then we're going to be supersetting that with curtsy lunges. It's going to be 10 stiff leg deadlifts and 20 curtsy lunges. I'm going to be doing this with 35 pound dumbbells. Hold them slightly on a diagonal and when we go down, we don't want to go down so far that we're having to bend our knees or round our backs too much. So let's do 10. And then we're going to go straight into curtsy lunges. Final exercise that I'm going to do is jump squats and I know some of you won't be able to do this because you can't do any jumping so just miss it out but I love getting these jump squats in because just at the end of the workout it's going to really challenge my legs, challenge my glutes, challenge those muscles. When we're working out from home we can't take a heavier weight so it's good to try and introduce different exercises that are going to challenge our muscles a bit more and a jump squat is exactly Exactly how it sounds it's just a squat with a jump in it don't forget 
forget to stretch off after that workout because it was pretty challenging, wasn't it? And do let me know in the comments section if you're going to try this workout. And do let me know if you'd like me to show you other workouts that I do in preparation for my next bikini competition. And do have a look at my Lean and Strong program, which has lots of these kind of workouts, which are going to help you build lean muscle and drop body fat. And the program also includes the kind of meal plans that I do. And if you like this video, give it the thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and get the bell notifications so you're notified when my videos first drop and do also give me a follow on Instagram and TikTok where I do a lot of fitness and weight loss stuff for women over 40.